From inmate to artist on display, Valentino Dixon spent 27 years in prison for a crime he didn't commit. He used art as therapy during all of those years, and now you can see his work for yourself. This piece right here is, is something that I just made off the top of my head. Valentino Dixon says that just knowing that this day was possible, having his art showcased at a place like the Birchfield Penny, kept him alive in prison. It you know, invigorated my spirit. It kept me strong. Uh, you know, prison is a dark place, and it gave me hope. Dixon was released from prison last year after serving nearly three decades for a murder he did not commit. He spoke at a forum at the Art Center Thursday with my colleague Claudine Ewing. I always knew in my heart that justice would prevail. I didn't know it was going to take 27 years. Dixon is known for his golf art, but doesn't restrict himself to that. He has around 40 pieces on display. The staff reached out to him because the Art Center's executive director says Dixon's story touches on so many issues, from the art and the role it plays in sustaining hope to social justice. I think Valentino sustained himself in prison through making art and sort of imagining a world and a life outside of the one he was living right then. And for him, amazingly, that has really come true and justice was served. And I think it tells all of us how important art can be uh, for sustaining hope and helping us be our best selves. Dixon says art is therapeutic and healing and that he spent 20 years drawing up to 10 hours a day, 365 days a year. I hope that it um, gives him a good idea of my journey and uh, how I utilize my time in prison. In the end, Dixon says he wants to make positive change in the world. Prison reform has become my mission, okay? So, you know, I want people to hear, you know, my voice and my views on prison reform and what we can do, you know, what we can do to make the system more fair, just and equal. So tonight was opening night, but Dixon's artwork will be on display from tomorrow through March 28th of next year. Just incredible. If you haven't seen it, you can He's either so go to so talented. His, yeah, yeah, I texted uh, Claudine, who was there tonight. Yeah. I said, where can we see all his work on his website also? It is amazing stuff, what he has been able to produce. And it's just so diverse. It's not just yeah. the golf scenes that we were seeing before. So talented. Yeah. So hopefully you can check that out. All right, we're